let me welcome you to the conversation. Mini! I'm Heil Russell. Uh, and I'm Matt Corner from Muff of um, the Internet. Hi, Matt. So, Matt, I'm starting a stopwatch. So we know this is actually going to be a mini and not just another long, ridiculous four-hour episode. So, oh, so we're going to do this episode in 30 minutes or less, or else the bus we're on will explode. Okay, but I'm still reeling from daylight saving time. So does that mean that it's there's some kind of slowing down of time at work here? Yes. The only reason I say that is because I think we're going to need a long time to talk about what we're here today to talk about, listeners. Well, time. we only have 30 minutes, and I'm starting it right now. All right, stopwatch has started. Hey, speaking of stopwatches, Matt. So yes, I invited you here to be with me, Matt Corna from off of DK Vine from off of the internet. Because yeah, if if there's anything people know about you, if people if people are on the street and they're talking, they're mm-hmm. talking about the current events of the day, and they're like, you know that Matt Corna guy from uh from yeah. from that Donkey Kong thing, and, and they'll be like, oh yes, he's he's delightful, and, and they'll say, if, if I know anything about that Matt Corna, that that Matt Corna. Uh, bloke, mm-hmm. that character, that 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 personality. It's that he's he's a man who enjoys TT, the anthropomorphic stopwatch from off of Diddy Kong Racing. That's true, isn't it? People do say that about me, and um, the most interesting thing about that is how long it takes people to say that about me. They always say, "Hey, that that Matt Corner, you know that one thing, you know, there's one thing about that Matt Corner." Go for it. it takes a long time for anyone to say anything about me, but that's true. I do. The main thing about me is that I like TT. We all like TT, but uh, for some reason... Yes, uh, but the main thing about me is that I like him. That, that, that's why you're here. I mean, I, I could right. have I, I, I could have had anybody else on DK. I, but I don't care who else likes him. The main thing about me is that. Right. No, I, I, I'm agreeing yeah. with you. We, we don't have to argue about this. I am agreeing okay. with you. And right. so you must have been really happy this past November 15th, which which will be a holiday to future generations, because yeah. November 15th, 2017, was the day Greg Mails, the legendary rare uh, designer, and, you know, he, he worked on Donkey Kong Country. He worked on uh, Donkey Kong Country 2. He worked on uh, Banjo-Kazooie, Tui. Grab by the Ghoulies, mm. Viva Pinata, and, and now Sea of Thieves. He he tweeted on his Twitter at Ghoulie Boy, uh, and he said, "It's 20 years since Rare Limited released." By the way, that's um, www.twitter.com. If just uh, just so you know, I, I I wasn't writing that down, and I'm gonna forget. So oh. luckily, luckily I I can use Google, and and I can search. Oh, how do we get the Twitter? Oh, uh, you go to Ask Jeeves, and then you you type in is that right? w- where is Google, and and then Jeeves, he was a butler. He will he will keep point you. Oh to yeah, Google. yeah, I know, I know that guy. We go we go way back. Me and how does he feel Jeeves, about TT? He, <laughs> he feels quite good about it, I think, because um, he he's um, he, he's a half stopwatch, I think. Well, you know, TT is is essentially a butler. Just, just the fingers, <laughs> just the fingers, <laughs> which we, which somehow comprises half of him. <laughs> well, you know, I've, uh, in his pictures, it's a lot more flattering. But if you ever meet him in real life, it's grotesque. <laughs> It's so, a horrible thing so to So Greg Bales, beloved designer, the Western Miyamoto, et cetera, et cetera, said uh, it, it's 20 years since at Rare Limited, which, which is which is where you can find Rare on the Twitter machine, released yes. hashtag Diddy Kong Racing. Uh, TT reckons... <laughs> as, it has, as it has subsequently become known. <laughs> TT reckons it's time for a drink to celebrate. So here is Greg Bales... Uh, promoting this child-friendly character uh, abuse of alcohol, so so that th- there's something, but it's not like conquered and already beat him to it. So here we have TT the stopwatch in a tavern from off of Sea of Thieves, and this is actually what appears to be the early version of Sea of Thieves, the the early build 
that uh, we, we've seen in some videos on uh, Rare's YouTube channel. And mm -hmm. so th this is TT standing in the middle of this tavern in front of what appears to be a bartender, but what also appears to be my imaginary friend, Sir Blobsworth, who yes. uh, I, I had dreams about when I was a child, when I was dreaming about what Donkey Kong Country 3 would look like before it was announced and and this is what i would have yeah. i would have dreams instead of sexual dreams i would have dreams about what the next donkey kong game would look like something that continues to this day by the way and when i say i don't have sexual dreams don't worry things still get plenty wet but with sir blob swift with sir yeah, blob I mean, yes so sir blob if i was Swift's dreaming about him I, I don't know how i'd control myself um, what? So I can understand that. It's Look, that, it's that, um, it's, it's that, most games must come. To, mm, yes, it is the mustache. Talking about the mustache of Sir Blobsworth because it just it just oozes masculinity, which which then causes me to ooze some masculinity. But yeah, and then the masculinity that you've oozed onto him is absorbed by the mustache, and he oozes some more. <laughs> Sir Blobsworth was was who I imagined, and that's what you call the circle of life. <laughs> it's who I imagined Diddy Kong would partner with in Donkey Kong Country Three. Because in in this dream, in this fevered childhood fantasy, uh, I I imagined a world where Diddy Kong was yeah. yet again the star of the next Donkey Kong Country game. And instead, you see, of I Dixie think Kong I completely misunderstood you there because I I thought what you meant was. Uh, for Donkey Kong Country 3, instead of releasing a game, we've released th th this. It's a kind of... It's a kind of blob man with a moustache, and you can have one. It's called Donkey Kong Country 3. Sir <laughs> Blobsworth. That's what I thought you meant. No, unfortunately... But it, but it wasn't. Please continue. No, I mean, I, I do think Sir Blobsworth would have made an excellent... Uh, Nintendo peripheral back in the day, you know, because Nintendo loves yeah, them. Yeah, something some to go with the Ultra Hand, perhaps. Mm. Certainly helps. Yeah, yeah. Yes, yes. So <laughs> uh, anyway, yeah, I I could definitely see Sir I'm glad Blobsworth. We agree. Sir Blobsworth being a failed like thing you, you have to plug into the uh, the N64 or something. And you, mm. uh, he he all he all he does is he gunks up your your controller sockets he doesn't really do anything except to ruin your well his mustache too. would uh, twirl around wouldn't it do you remember i do remember because i think we i think we uh, there, there was some leaked uh, design documents about uh, this particular peripheral wasn't there back in the day so do you remember just for the record, could, um, 7 hmm? minutes have passed since i've pressed start on a stopwatch so we we've talked more about Sir Blobsworth than we have TT. This 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 is already proving to be a disaster. So ignore Sir Blobsworth. He this bartender. I don't know that I can. <laughs> <laughs> then we're in trouble, Matt. Then we're in trouble. Uh no, this uh this 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 bartender looks like a pill man. And that's just what they use in the uh, the prototype, the, the, this early build of Sea of Thieves. They use pill people as representations for actual right. NPCs. But, but TT, TT's standing there. So. Yes, and that, I suppose this is the thing, isn't it? Because you would think that, oh, well, presumably they've just put him in as a kind of placeholder character for what they will eventually put in the game. But no. They've got Sir Blobsworth for that. They got the assets off Nintendo from their original design documents, if you remember. And um, so, no, what they've done is they've started to replace the Blobsworths with the with the ones that are actually going to be in it. And and one of them that is TT. Yes, that's what the, the end of that sentence was okay, going to okay, be. Yes. Oh, okay, 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 okay. So TT. Of course, the stopwatch from Diddy Kong Racing. You, you, you know, he he ran the uh, the the lobbies of the various worlds in the game. And <laughs> he ran them very well. He did. He did. He he was essentially. There, there was some fucking well-run lobbies right there in Diddy Kong Racing. Yeah, it was. It's a, it's a great lobby. He was essentially and the a one thing I like about Diddy Kong Racing is the lobbies. I love them lobbies. I love a good lobby. Please continue. 
No, he, he was he was he was the butler of Timbers Island. He was the Jeeves, if you will. Except he was one hundred percent stopwatch, uh, or or well fingers. Well, that's probably why uh, Jeeves was never the resounding success he was. He always felt he was destined to be. It's the uh, genealogy. <laughs> so. <laughs> Rare does own TT, by the way. This is—I I know there are a lot of misconceptions. They own him. They own him. They—they—they uh, uh, they own him. At the very least, he's an indentured servant. They—they they own him. He—he he is one of the characters they own that Nintendo has never owned. They—they they got the rights to TT, and they can do whatever they want with TT, including putting him in Sea of Thieves, apparently. So, That's what so happened horrific. on Twitter when Greg Mails? tweeted this was uh, uh, of course i i had to i had to remark i had to comment i had to make a big deal out of this and i so i pleaded with anybody who would listen i screamed to the winds and i said Mm. please rare please pull the trigger on this nonsense i want tt and sea of thieves make it happen some way i'm i'm thirsty for it now and i need this thirst quenched and hmm. so uh, Sea of Thieves, uh, Andrew Preston, he, uh, he, he happened to like or, or, or he, he hearted or whatever you, you call it when you do something on Twitter to somebody else's post. And Fun like. He, he, uh, he, 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 he responded to it by, by, by clicking the thing, the heart. And he said, uh, or I said, uh, we, we, I want TT as an item in this game who actually works as an actual stopwatch and, and to fit the Sea of Thieves aesthetic, you know, you can make them a little bit more dirty and rugged than uh, we, we've grown accustomed to, so long as it is recognizably TT. And Well, that'd be nice, but the one we saw wasn't anyway. I don't know. Sorry, I just started saying a sentence and then forgot what I meant by it. Please continue. Well, well, the, the thing is, think- if you look at the this prototype, uh, none of the uh, items or props really had the chance to be... Well, no, but yeah, sorry, that's what I meant. Like, so there's nothing in... It looks like an N64 one. They're all geometric shapes. I don't know if you've heard of them, geometric shapes. They're different to normal shapes. So it's like circles and squares that mm. TT's made of. But I mean, you know, you know the geometric shapes; those ones. No, I, 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 I've, I've heard of them. I, I asked Jeeves yeah. about them once. He well, took me to Google. He, he probably started I, banging on about his um, uh, butling career. <laughs> so uh, what? 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 Where? Where were we before we got on the shapes? Uh, oh yeah. So no. In in this in this build in in this early build of Sea of Thieves, this is before they make everything like actually. F- finished and polished the way it actually appears in the game that's why the Mm -hmm. npcs are pill people but in the actual game they make all the props dirty and and a little cracked and nicked and everything's dingy in sea of thieves including the thieves themselves and and sometimes the sea and Mm -hmm. so basically tt the way he appears in this screenshot from from the sea of thieves early build shouldn't be representative of the way tt would actually appear in the final game he he would be a little bit more muted in, a, in his color scheme he wouldn't look like the, the neon yellow and red uh, mcdonald's happy meal that he does now but you see i i um i disagree with you there heil russell Oh, okay. I, I, uh, I do not want to see TT in any form other than his original. You see, you see, you see. This is this is where you and I we, we differ, Matt. This is this is where we do part we? ways. Yes. Do you think? I am basically desperate for TT and Sea of Thieves. Like I said, I have the thirst now. Right. I have not even the thirst. It's a, it's a full blown hunger at this. Oh, point. Right. You'll even have a dirty one if it if it comes to that. I I will take a dirty. Oh, give it, give me a dirty one. I don't even mind. I will take a used TT. I I I I I will not even need a mint on card. I will need my TT just completely uh, scuzzy if need be. If I can get TT and Sea of Thieves, this is this is how much the hunger uh, needs to be satiated. And 
uh, DK Vine staffer Cameron Regal and I were talking about it just a little bit. We we talk about TT, Cameron and I, from time to time. And he had the idea. Um, well, on top of my idea, because my idea was just make him an actual stopwatch in the fucking game. Like, we have a compass in Sea of Thieves, right? So why can't the mm. pirates have a stopwatch if they want to time themselves? Like, okay, who... Is the compass alive? The compass is not alive, but... What?! No, I'm sorry. There are not googly-eyed compasses, if that's what you're asking. I don't think I'm breaking the NDA what kind of, by kind of saying game there is are no this? googly-eyed compasses. Well, I mean, they, they could at least put one of them in. Whoa, 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 okay, hold up, Matt. Hold up, Matt. You're getting outraged. You're getting angry, and I feel well, like... I, I, I think I've don't, got... I think I'm entitled to be. We don't... There's no... Okay, for one thing, there's no time to get angry, because we're already at 15 minutes. We got 15 minutes to wrap this up. We got to put this puppy to bed. I don't know why it's a dog now, when we were talking about bl- blob people and stopwatches, but there's now a dog here, too. So, here's what we got to do, Matt. Okay, so... Uh, mm-hmm. an actual stopwatch in the game so the pirates can maybe time themselves digging up holes or something. I, I don't know. Whatever you want to do with a stopwatch. You know what pirates are like. They're always doing it. Yeah, okay. Fair enough. Okay, okay, okay. So, so you got, you got the got the dig, dig, digging up holes with the pirates and you're like, ooh, let's time ourselves. Ooh, we're silly pirates. So then, all right. That was so a very can, good impression, by the way. Yeah, uh, that, that's, that's, that's the way my pirate sounds in Sea of Thieves. So, yeah, yeah. Cameron yeah, went... Went one step further, and he said, "In game, we can call this the thieves' timepiece." And you see, because each yes. word starts with the, the the letter T, and it's that kind of brilliance that is the reason we pay Cameron so much money on DK Vine. Mm. That's very good. What other things that begin with T and T are there? Do you think? There's literally nothing. That's true. Nothing. So, Cameron, your genius has been recognized. So here, here's what I want to do, Matt. Uh, okay. I, Rare yes, might actually... tell me pl- what you want to do. Okay, okay. L- listen to me, Matt. Listen, listen, listen. Rare might okay, actually... Okay, I will listen to you. Oh, Matt! All right. Rare might actually be planning on putting TT in Sea of Thieves, the video game, for the Microsoft. Well, you know what? I'm taking that tweet as tacit confirmation because it Look, wasn't what, a pill person. Well, here's what you got to ask yourself, Matt. Why does that picture exist if TT is not in Sea of Thieves? Yeah, exactly. Did, did Greg Mails just stumble into the Sea of Thieves room at rare and, and did he did, did he just like get on a computer giggling to himself and did he just concoct a tt model in in the early build and and, and yeah. why would he do this why would anybody do this it would be massively distasteful it, uh, do you think those um disgusting. what was that imaginary friend of yours called mr bungles or something do you think mr bungles, bungles will be in as well I, I can't imagine that Mr. Bungles or any of the other pill people will be in the actual game. But you know what? I, I want one pill person in you there. You have a very limited imagination, though, don't you? You can't imagine that. No, I, I, I can't even imagine like, what, what happens when, when people like put their hands over my eyes. As far as I'm concerned, the world ceases to exist. Oh, yeah, that happens to me as well. Yeah. It's been that way since okay. I was a baby. and, and uh, I wish I... I wish I could imagine stuff. Yeah. You know I wish I was favorite... like John Lennon. Yeah, I was going to say, you know what my favorite John Lennon song is? Um, uh, Park Life. Yes. Yes, mine as well. Yes. I love that. So, so anyway, uh, yeah, it, it would be disgusting if, if Greg Mails and, and, or a whole conspiracy of Sea of Thieves staffers we're just toying with our emotions at this point. No, no, we we need TT and Sea of Thieves. The hunger, the hunger. Well, Greg. exactly, exactly. But because they wouldn't do that, would they? They, they wouldn't they, they do shouldn't. that. No. So I don't think Greg Males would do that. I take back every nice thing I ever said about Greg Males. If he would do this, and he knows that he knows this. we would because we've said lots of nice things, but we can take them back. We can take them right back. 
Everything is we retractable. We can take them back. And th- yeah, exactly. So, um, yeah, but... And because he knows that, and because of how much it means to him that we don't take them back, and because he knows how it will affect all of those things that... You know, the nice things we said. Because of that, he, he just... It would not be in his interest to do that. It, things would go very wrong for him if he did that. Just to be clear, we are not threatening anybody. <laughs> we are just... We, we, no, we, we're just saying. Just It will affect him emotionally if all those nice things we said were taken back. Right. We're, we're just going to be That's mean. That's all we're saying. All we're saying is we're just going to be mean. Oh. We're just going to be mean. <laughs> so... <laughs> Here's what here's what I want to do, Matt. All right. So, so so hopefully, yeah, yeah. Rare is planning on putting TT somewhere in Sea of Thieves as, as a cheeky nod to the longtime fans. But just in case this was just a cruel, cruel prank, we need to let them know that their public demands TT in Sea of Thieves. Now, yes, you might does. be asking you yourselves at home or in car. Or wherever you listen to this, in jail probably. In Why would this be a good thing for you? I mean, th- this this is the kind of weirdo stuff we worry about. But you, you don't care about TT and CFT. You, I see you. I see you not caring out there. Why should you help us with this? Well, listen, listen. All right, TT and C of Thieves would technically then make Sea of Thieves a Diddy Kong Racing spin-off game. The exact right. same as Star Fox Adventures is a Diddy Kong Racing spin-off game. And, and I don't think there could be any points of contention about that. Absolutely not. There is also mm-hmm. Banjo-Kazooie and Conquer, but really, especially Star Fox Adventures, is the most spin-off E yeah. of Diddy Kong Racing you can get. Yeah. The, the, the tricky games. The, 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 yeah, yeah, the, I, I, as they're known, as they're known, yeah. uh, it, yeah. in Super Smash Brothers uh, Brawl, when you unlock the trophies, it, it says... Uh, Star uh, Fox from the Tricky series. Yeah, right, exactly. So, so anyway... Uh, yeah, uh, by the way, that's the name of the character, isn't it? Star Fox. Yeah. yeah I'm, good at, I'm good at knowing the names of characters, aren't I? You are. That, that, yeah, that... Uh, w- w- wait, w- uh, what, what's the name of, uh, what, what's the, name of the, the character we're talking about right now? Oh yeah, Timothy t- Time, t- t- Timothy t- Timothy, Timothy. Yeah, okay. So, yeah. what this would also do is it would retcon Timothy as a centuries-old magical pirate artifact, um, because up until now we've said TT was brought to life by Taj through genie magic, and because he mm. he he was a lonely he was a lonely elephant genie and he wanted some friends, and so his yeah. best his best friend was a stopwatch. And so he brought him yeah. to life, and, and, and I don't said, think "There's anything unreasonable about that." Yeah, and, and, and he said, "You know, I want you to run my lobbies," and, and that's uh, and, and so then uh, that that's how TT was born. And that's how uh, Timbers Island got its pristine lobbies. That's right. Yeah, the, the so. famous lobbies. But what this would actually do would be it would retcon him, retroactive continuity him as a centuries-old mm. magical pirate artifact who came to Timbers Island. Uh, probably when the pirate ship that was carrying him uh, crashed in Pirate Lagoon or something. And I feel like that is pretty much the feeling I got from seeing TT back in 1997 when I first played Diddy Kong Race. And I thought, you know, this guy... Yeah, he's got that vibe about him, hasn't he? Yeah. It was like, you know, this guy's nice, but if he was a centuries-old magical pirate artifact who came to Timber's Island on Pirate Lagoon... Well, that would make more sense, and I don't know why Rare didn't go in that direction. I really hope they elaborate on this hunch I have some at some point in the future. So well, I think it's all factored in, isn't it? It's all factored in. They've, they've obviously been this is this has been a long game for Rare Limited, hasn't it? Ever since 1997, they've been wanting to do the origin story of TT. I w- I would go one step further, Matt. I would say that Rare. Uh, accepted Nintendo's offer to do a Donkey Kong game back in 1993 uh, for it to come out in 94. So they could one day uh, introduce this, this stopwatch so they could one day do its backstory in a pirate game. I I can't imagine that not being the case really. If you look, if you, but you can only see that in retrospect. 
No one would have ever known. It, it, it's it's such um it, I mean the series is so deep the the Donkey Kong series is mm. so rich and really it it, it is the they're too, they're too deep if anything do you not yeah, think it, it's true but I yeah, mean I play the game I'm thinking these games are too deep yeah I, I can't get over the depth it, it it really is just probably the most intellectual work of art. In the last 200 to 300 years, um, no arguments sure. here, but yeah, that that's that. And so, you know, it, it's 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 obvious now when I was playing Donkey Kong Country, I thought one day, one day, this character, this monkey sidekick is going to get a, a game where he races around in a hovercraft and then mm. and then only then. Well, well, it makes sense because he'll obviously befriend uh, a magical pirate artifact who came to Timbers Island on Pirate Lagoon. Exactly. So we 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 have uh, we, we we're, we're we're running out of time. We have like five more minutes left on the stopwatch. So here's it's just here, not here's enough what, time. Here's what we need to do, Matt. Here's what we need to rally people to do. Yes, and I'm very much in favor of a rally. We should, we should hold a rally. Well, you know, we have lots of options. Sea of Thieves has been announced as coming out on March 20th, 2018. So we have to, to really um, get TT in the game uh, on launch day one. So we need... Oh, so you don't think he's already in it? You think... Okay, yeah, no, fair enough. No, no, he, he, think... could, he could be in it. He could be in it. He could be in it. Uh, but... We, we we just got to make sure because yeah I mean, yes all right they could always add they might, TT they might later have cut too. him for time am I right <laughs> oh <laughs> so rare is very reachable through the internet so I yes, don't so want to really bug them to to pester them to to become a living nightmare to them hmm. but no we, me we, neither but what we could do is get other people to. We could, yeah. So, yes. Let's get the hashtag, hashtag TT and Sea of Thieves trending. I, I yes. want it trending. I don't just want a couple people to use it. I want it to no. always be on that column in Twitter where it says, like, trend, trending tweets and uh, trending hashtags. And I, I want that always on there. Always. Mm. From now till March 20th. And... It would be especially potent if you added uh, a, a rare uh, social media account in, in your pleading. So there's, of course, at rare limited, uh, limited spelled out LTD uh, because mm-hmm. they're, 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 they're too cool for school, uh, at Sea of Thieves, and why not at KS Rivals, Connect Sports Rivals, just, you know, yeah. to cover our bases. But I, I always put at. Chaos rivals in it, all my tweets anyway. I think it's just fun to do, right? But uh, yeah, I like the idea of lots of people doing tweets with absolutely no content other than a hashtag and some ats. <laughs> well, you, I mean, look, you can do fan art, you can you can get tattoos, you can tattoo your face to look like TT, uh, and, mm-hmm. and and so long as you have the hashtag TT and C of these hashtag somewhere else. Also in tattooed. Body. I also employers would love that too. I, I've spoken mm. I've spoken to all prospective bosses you'll ever have and they all agree we would hire that person and we Yeah, get you them spent a, a long rage. time doing that, didn't you? Yeah. That was like a big chunk of your year. Yeah, I mean that that's that's why I've been so busy. People say, Hi, oh, why are you well, you always complain about how busy you are. You mm-hmm. run a goddamn Donkey Kong sh- website. I just want to double check that it's okay to get TT tattooed on your face, you know, for various jobs in America. Which it turns out is quite big. It's actually, you can be president if you have TT tattooed on your face. That's true, isn't it? That's because why Donald um, Trump is uh, his some, so something, orange. Something, I don't know. The joke. Someone I do made, a joke there. I made a, a joke. Jo- I made a, a joke. joke. I made a joke about Donald Trump's skin. That's a good joke. It's great. Nobody's ever done one of those. No. And, you know, no, nobody's probably ever thought to make fun of him either. So I'm the first. I did not. Oh, okay. Yeah. Someone should. So hashtag, 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 TT in Sea of Thieves. 
Let's 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 make it happen, people. Let's let Rare know he's got to be in the game because we're not psychologically well. And and the game who, wouldn't make sense if he wasn't in it. That's, that's what right. they need to understand. That's right. That's right. Yes. Okay. So. We, we are coming See up- a thieves, TT. See a thieves, TT. You can make it into a chant if you want. In fact, why don't you um, make it into a real life rally? Um, if you contact me privately, I can give you the vague direction of where their offices are. I mean, the information is publicly available, but, you know. Anyway, my idea is that we just sort of just storm the place and just. What? That- we're, and we're going too far watch. again. The stopwatch. We're out of time. We're out of time. You know. So, All right. so that, that's it. You know. Hey, you know what, Matt? Maybe we should have campaigned for something meaningful, like to save net neutrality. But, oh well. This has been a File Two production. Perico.